Hey guys, uh, welcome to an interesting uh, product that I have in front of me right now. It's this HD, which you should forget about it, battery IP camera. And uh, the certifications, you gotta forget about those too. And the camera is supposed to be this on the picture, and you'll see why that's relevant right now. It's supposed to be the A9 version, whatever that means. And these are some manufacturer's notes. Uh, features batteries, night mode, Wi-Fi, alarm, HD, and an SD card, the mobile phone network camera, whatever that stands for. And let's take the camera out. This one is actually very funny. And, <laughs> and uh, the camera itself is actually white inside. The stand, my, the micro stand, I would say, is black, but... You know, it just doesn't match the picture, but what's the big deal, right? A micro USB, which might be the longest you've ever seen in your life. It's, uh, it's probably four inches long, which, you know, good. <laughs> an SD card, it came with an SD card. It's a 64 gigs, probably not the fastest. And here's the camera unit itself. And uh, there is some kind of instructions here for how to download it and connect the app and all that good stuff. Now, for the camera, it has a piece of plastic, which I will gladly peel off, which I like that stuff. Now, this camera is interesting because it's magnetized. On the bottom here, and uh, this base here, this is adhesive, so you put it somewhere, and this is a magnet and they come together like this it doesn't always stay on the center but you are not supposed to question that part this is supposed to be a baby camera or surveillance camera i'm not sure what they really aimed for and we're not gonna read the manual because that's how it works and here's our sd card i'm gonna plug it in and it's a 64 gig yep third at number three and it's a 10 actually it's a class 10 on print here so i'm not sure in reality but on print it says class 10 and that's not the slowest and i'm trying to put it in the opposite side looks like uh, let me put it in the device itself in the proper way if i can but there's no way to feel where it's supposed to be here <laughs> oh this is this is hilarious okay i think i found it oh yeah it's right here let's see if my okay yeah so it's there now and i already connected it with a million difficulties and my phone is a fingerprint magnet i can do nothing about it now let's go the ca the camera app is called v720 <laughs> that's that's some creative name by the way and uh here's the camera itself and it should not show right now offline right now let me hit on here this is the button and there's a small light here and when it's steady device now should be and it says to allow location which is very interesting why does it need my location just for a camera and uh, let's go to the device and it says device offline again let's reload the page and it should connect somehow but now it does not want to connect okay as you see somehow this camera decided to work in the end but i have no idea what what's going on with it as you see you see cables right i'm actually pointing it at the uh monitor and now you may not hear me because i have to go so far in order for you to see anything on this camera as you see i am probably a few feet away from my monitor right now i might be around eight feet from the monitor and you only see one monitor from 10 feet away <laughs> this camera is just so genius and so good and well thought and uh, let me film it from above and look how how much it zooms in it's literally next to the next to the camera here it's uh on top and for some reason it just likes to zoom in look i can see the corner of the phone from this distance or from here it almost acts like an endoscope camera instead and uh supposedly this is a magnetic holder for it but you're not supposed to shake it that much because it comes out of it too easy way too easy as you see boom that's the super magnet we're talking about a real super magnet <laughs> now this is this is so interesting <laughs>
Oh my god, I'm just uh, having fun with this camera. I just wanted to show it to you guys that so you don't fall for it, by the way. And uh, it's not bad if you have nothing else. You could probably use it, but what would you use it for? I have no idea because the battery doesn't live that long unless you have it plugged in. And sometimes it doesn't work if it's plugged in. And it's it's all all around very interesting i would say i'm not gonna say anything else but just i would say interesting that to a point that it doesn't make sense let me try to show you my microphone with this camera and as you see you can see my microphone as if you would see it on a telescope on a microscope and i am around good three feet away from the microphone this camera is at least three feet away from the microphone <laughs> Now this is this is too interesting now. Let me put it on the keyboard. Okay. And look, it 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 works. It almost works. The colors now are extremely inaccurate because my keyboard is actually green under the buttons right now. But the camera decides to put a different color. And uh, it has options here on the app, if the app decides to work. Uh, let me see the manual allow, of course, more permissions. We just like a lot of permissions with this camera. What's wrong with you? <laughs> okay, let me go from a, a little bit further away, and I'll try to put this video on the main video, so you'll see the recording quality. And this is literally 10 feet away. I'm having to scream on my microphone for you guys to even hear me. This is 10 feet away. And that is very interesting. 10 feet away and it zooms in <laughs> like it's binoculars. Anyway, I'm not gonna bore you more with this extremely beautiful product. And uh, yeah, just kind of stay away from scams, I guess. Unless you find it for a buck or two and you want to test around with it yeah i guess you could try the battery holds maybe maybe 40 minutes if it's full charge and besides that nothing else is guaranteed and other settings here yes oh the infrared light or the night vision e yeah it has to be manually open or closed here you put open now it's in uh, ir you put closed it's in normal and if you hit play back, you play back supposedly what's on the micro SD card, which I might end up using for something else. And uh, with that said, that was it. We'll see you next time. I hope you got a good laugh, at least from this one. Bye.